Hello everybody, this is Chana Uzuhai here with another RPC rant and review. Uh, today's RPC will be Asuna Hayanamaki. Um, this RPC isn't a real RPC, it's actually a stolen RPC from Asuna Sakurai. And so I'm going to be explaining this RPC's flaws, both the RPC -er and a few other things. So, yeah. First of all, I would like to talk about the original owner of this RPC, Asuna Sakurai. So, this RPC belongs to a girl from Germany named Kim, um, and from what I've known about Asuna is that she is a beautiful blonde RPC character, and she has been coupled with some other RPCs and, you know, things like that. Now, I don't know a lot about her information, but I'm not really going over her. Uh, what I will say is that this character is the original, and has always been the original. It's not a copy. Um, her owner did have some contests for her and such, but she, you know, she still owned her. She didn't replace her. She didn't adopt her. It's her own creation. Um, also, her design is the original, and there's nothing... You know, flaws about that. Now about Asuna Hainamaki. Okay, so this girl, from when I've known her, she has both a YouTube and a Facebook. Her Facebook is Asuna Hainamaki or whatever. Uh, I don't know how to say it. Anyways, so she claims that this RPC belongs to her when really it belongs to Asuna Sakurai. Um, it's obvious that it belongs to Asuna Sakurai because it's her exact RPC. It has her, it's about the exact same outfit, her same colors, practically everything the same. Um, even on this girl's account, she had a picture of Asuna Sakurai as her profile picture, and as, you know, as usual, she denied it. And so I told her about it, and she said it belonged to her, and yada yada yada. And also, people from Facebook, like, in our RPC Stealers group, which of course all fake RPCs, or people who steal, and you know, such. Uh, so that she was fake. And so, here are some edits of her RPC. I don't think she's edited them, because I always see her asking for RPC requests and such. She even asked me to make one, but I didn't, because, you know, for reasons. Um, also, about this character, is the fact that she not only looks like Asuna, but she doesn't even roleplay. Like, I mean, I don't know if she role plays, but from what I've seen on her Facebook and her YouTube, she mostly just asks for requests, and then she posts them on her wall or something. She might say thank you, and then after that, she'll be like, oh, can you make me more, or it's my own character. Uh, her character has no story, so I'm not gonna go over that and be like, oh, she has no story or whatever, because, for one, it's not her original RPC, and two, uh... I haven't seen one, and I've asked her about it, and I just never got any results. Um, let's see some pictures of her. So, she looks just like Asuna Sakurai, so here's a picture of her in her full body outfit, and as you can tell, because here's a comparison, uh, it's just like Asuna Sakurai. I mean, it has the same exact shirt, um, a little bit different pants and such, but still, the same idea. It's same thing. Uh, the same hairstyle, even. Uh, hair color, yada yada. So, for the stealer, I mean, please, you can only say that you, you know, want to give credit to Asuna Sakurai for the original idea, but you don't own the RPC or the original idea. Um, when I talked to this girl, she also said that she owned this idea because she, uh, found it or something. I don't even know. She didn't even find it. She just claimed it to be hers and then asked for edits. Okay, next thing. Oh, so on Facebook there was a nice person named, where is he? La la la. Uh, Yuri Kazame, uh, which I think is uh, another German rpc -er. I'm not sure. I don't want to say his name because I don't know what that means. Anyways, so I've seen on her wall that he made at least five of these pictures for her, like, just about all of them except for two, or three, and so, 
I mean, he's the he or she is a great editor, but it shows that in a way that she, he's kind of enslaved to her because she wants him to edit, and she's just I don't know, like I don't know. I'm not gonna I'm gonna try not try not to judge her, but in a way I should kind of judge her. Uh, the other picture he made for her is like I guess of Asuna, but it really looks. I don't know, maybe it's just me, it looks kind of like Naruko because of the face markings and because of the darker orange hair and the, and the orange clothes. So, I don't, oh yeah, look, and it had a little Uzumaki thing in her hair pin band, whatever it is on her uh, left side. Um, and uh, so, I don't know if she, she he made this because she told him to, or what, but I mean... If I gotta ask the question, I mean, I'm gonna ask the question. Who's not gonna ask the question? Um, is she supposed to represent a demon or an Uzumaki or what? Because, I mean, I thought she was Sakurai, and I don't know, you know, what that composed of. I mean, there's so many RPCs that, you know, have really cool last names and whatever. So, I'm not gonna be like, oh, well, that belongs to Kakashi, that belongs with uh, Naruto, that belongs with Sasuke, yada, 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 yada. So, that's all I have to say about that. Um, let's see here. Oh, so from what I've seen in just about all the pictures, not only the outfit is that she is really high with powers like uh, ninjutsu and uh, medical jutsu, ninjutsu and all that stuff and any kind of any kind of jutsu. And she always has this power, and no matter what, she can't be defeated. She can't die. She can't, you know, all that weird. Uh, stuff about staying alive forever. So, yeah, that just it doesn't work out because RPCs, you know, they represent people or whatever you want them to represent, you know. They don't, people will die and are gonna die anyways. I mean, okay, let's face it. People are gonna die one day. That's it. Okay, on to the next and last thing. That really, 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 really bothers me. Well, not exactly, but yeah. So, from the pictures that I've seen people make for her, or edit for her, or whatever, she, some of them have been paired with, like, you know, couples, and so far from what I see here is there's one with Shikamaru, she's kissing him, one with her and Gara, and one with her and Neji. Yeah, so, the question is, who is she paired with? I mean, it's hard to ask because she's not even... I don't know. She didn't even belong to you in the first place, like the original idea. And so, I don't know. I mean, is she paired with one person? Is she just a random flirter? Are these her teammates? Did she fall in love with Shikamaru? Is she like Gara? I don't know. Just please try to clear that up. Um, I mean, in my opinion, I've never seen Gara in love with people. But then again, I'm not going to say anything because, you know, everyone has their own RPCs and their opinions and how, you know, their characters fall in love with another character, and yada yada. Uh, Neji, kind of the same thing. I don't, you know, I don't see him as a close person. Uh, and Shikamaru. Shikamaru, I mean, for him to like a girl, that's so rare. I mean, he was always complaining about girls. Even his mom, one time, he's like, oh, you know, that's such a drag, my mom's calling me, or whatever. So, I don't know how that works out. So, just to kind of end it, I'd like to ask, for the owner, and I'll send this to you so you can see it, just to be fair. Uh, if you could please just, like, tell me or tell us, the whole RPC world, why you stole the original Asuna Sakurai's idea on her outfit, on her style, on her information, too. I mean, she, you even copied her information. Um, and all of this. I mean, you've denied it so many times, but we have so much proof that you stole it from her. You, you, just, you just don't have a way out. Um, so, yeah, so, that's pretty much it. Um, this character, overall, she's just, she's just not a real character at all. I mean, I, I, can't, I don't really want to say that, but, I mean, from this girl, or this person who claims to own her, she doesn't edit her, she doesn't really roleplay with her, she doesn't do really anything with her, she just asks for others to edit for her, which I guess is okay, but, I mean, all the time, it's kind of like, well, then that's really not your RPC, that's just, you know, a random picture. Oh, 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 another thing. 
when she asked one of the girls, or someone, I don't know what the girl, I think it's a girl, I don't know, for a request, she sent them a picture of Hawaii and Sasuke, and that person edited over Hawaii to edit Asuna. I don't have that picture in here because it's in a YouTube video, but I'll link it below. And so, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I, I'm kind of surprised that she didn't know a picture of, like, Sakura or Ino or Tsunade or Hinata from an already edited RPC. So maybe that's her mistake. I don't know. I'm not going to say anything about that. But overall, I think, honestly, just try to claim your own RPC and not, you know, steal or just don't claim all those RPCs. That's not right. You know, they're not yours. If you want to make your own RPC, my best advice is to either A, adopt an RPC from an RPC adopter because they're always happening, or B, just try to make something up on your own, and then as you go, you can always make RPC contests, or, you know, things like that. Or ask your friends to help you with, you know, outfit ideas, boyfriend ideas, teammates, etc, etc, etc. So, yeah, um, that's pretty much all I had, because, you know, like I said before, she's not a real character, so I'm not gonna bash any more on her, more like the owner. So, yeah, alright, well, this is a RPC review on Asuna Hinanaki or whatever, and my next one will be really soon, so thanks for watching, okay, bye!